Welcome back, everybody. Today we had some huge news revealed by Hasbro about a new Force FX lightsaber we are getting, which is a Rey Skywalker's lightsaber from Episode 9. This is one I've been looking forward to for a really, really long time. They just released it in Galaxy's Edge not too long ago. But this one has a little difference on it that I think is going to be a big selling point for fans of Rey, Rey Skywalker and her saber. So let's take a look at the little video reveal of it and then we'll kind of take a look at some photos and break it down and discuss a little bit more about Rey's Skywalker Force FX lightsaber. We, uh, we saw this saber a couple of years ago and knew it was going to make it to the line eventually. And so for our first Force Effects Elite line, this is the first time we've done this blade color, and it's got some great new features. It's the Ray Skywalker lightsaber from Look how gorgeous. Rise of Skywalker. So, all right, and I've got one of them in hand. So let's take a look. This thing is fantastic. Oh, look so at that detail. All these great details and fabric wrap. And one of my favorite things is that we did this. This right here. Switch here for the, the Ignite Twist feature. Twist to Ignite. But fabric wrap just does all this great it wears in over time so it's it's nice and clean here i'll grab another one this one's got the blade on it but you can see here so if you watch close inside these these little holes you'll see the blade ignite when i rotate this <gasps> oh wow so you get a great little flash of the that's green gorgeous. and blue oh my gosh. just like in the show yeah. i love the yellow on that it looks so good it does the yellow the yellow is great it's kind of the like really deep golden orange yellow and then i'll do this again but if you look inside these holes here on the neck you'll see a little flash of blue and green oh, wow. just super accurate and timed out to the movie so i love that just twist great to details like that the the sounds in here were all created for the movie they weren't all used in the movie but they were created for it so this is a great chance to really hear all those sounds created for that and really get the full experience the the secondary activation button for all those great other features, the wall cut. Oh, look stuff. how That's pretty where here. the blade inserts. The blaster those deflects, open up. Everything that we've done on previous ones. Um, if I if I take the emitter end off of this thing, so you see the pedals here all folded flat. Yep. I take it off of this oh, one. Oh, okay. So That's I've got this off. part now. And I take it and I go to put it over the, put the blade through. The blade. You can see those pop open. Oh, it's so pretty. you slide that down on, so that then you've got the open pedals on the one with the blade in it. So man, those get some fine great details are so nice. Out of those things, like folding back, nice clicks into place, just beautiful. Makes stuff. it pretty if you're so, displaying it too without that blade. Really great things like the the weathering on the on the fabric, some printed on stuff, but then it's also designed so that with these these raw edges of the fabric, it'll wear in over time. So the more you hold it and the more you interact with it. Like this one that I've got here is a, is a great example where I've just been playing with this one a bunch. So these edges have started to fray a little oh, bit yeah. more and look even more like the, the prop. So just beautiful, fun stuff there. Oh, I can't wait, you all. So one of my favorites that we've ever here done. Up. Just a great piece. Oh, so pretty. So Not a first there. That's other awesome. things are, yeah. And our... The packaging for this kind of follows the same style as we have for previous FX Elite lightsabers. So you see that like great new yellow colors there, all that. So just super excited about this one. And between the Looks sounds like and all the features and it's got the color changes and stuff, all, all that's just really great. So uh, this one available at most major retailers, including Hasbro Pulse um, in the US, Canada, UK. Available for pre-order tomorrow at 1 Eastern Time and on shelf spring of 2022. And Chris, I'm seeing, is it this yes. is the first? All right, guys. So there you go. Um, we have a release date pre-order tomorrow, September 9th. And it's going to go on sale on shelf spring of 2022. Man, how beautiful. Let's take a look at some of these screenshots of the Saber. So. Here it is, in all its beautiful glory. Um, one little detail, you're either gonna love it or you're gonna hate it. Ray Skywalker on the box. I love it. Um, it's so gorgeous though, the stand's beautiful. This is a stand they've been using on a lot of their uh, sabers lately. 
but it's just a gorgeous display stand. It's nice it comes with it. One thing I really love is they were showing off these articulating um, parts is that those fold in and close so that when you're displaying it on the stand, it's gonna be really pretty. You're gonna have some detail on the top. Um, the yellow blade is gorgeous. They're using new LED technology in this blade that they haven't used in any lightsabers previously, and it's supposed to be their most realistic lightsaber to date. So I'm really intrigued. I can't wait to get my hands on it. And then I was telling you guys earlier on, one of the things that is drawing me in towards this is that twist to ignite. You're gonna be able to just twist it, turn that bad boy on, and it's good to go. And how amazing is that? Um, I'm super stoked for this blade, for this saber. It goes on sale in most retail stores tomorrow, September 9th. Um, let me know if you're going to get your hands on one. I'm definitely going to be having multiple sites up trying to pre-order. Maybe I'll do it live on stream. Um, come check it out, twitch.tv forward slash it's Captain Falcon. See, see if we can get our hands on a pre-order of this, because this is a must-have for me. I am a huge fan of the sequels. This saber in general is one of the most gorgeous in the star wars universe in my opinion and i can't wait to pull it out of the box and ignite that thing and just hold it in my hands it's going to be so awesome guys what a good time to be a star wars fan hope you enjoyed this um video if you did make sure to subscribe leave a like and drop a comment down below on what you're most looking forward to um about the race skywalker saber if you're going to be trying to get your hands on one yourself and i will see you guys next time